3% of the Earth's water is fresh. 2.5% of the Earth's fresh water is unavailable. Locked up in glaciers, polar ice caps, atmosphere, and soil. Highly pol polluted or lies too far under the Earth's surface to be extracted at an affordable cost. 0.5% of the Earth's water is available fresh water. Only about 3% of the Earth's water is fresh water. Of that, only about 1.2% can be used as drinking water. The rest is locked up in glaciers, ice caps, and permafrost, or buried deep in the ground. 20 years ago, in 2001, the UN Population Fund warned that the world will begin to run out of fresh water by 2050. In UNFPA's World Population Report from 1992, also warns of water shortages by 2050. We will run out of fresh water before oil, and that's a reality check. While our planet as a whole may never run out of water, it's important to remember that clean fresh water is not always available where and when humans need it. In fact, half of the world's fresh water can be found in only six countries. Also, every drop of water that we use continues through the water cycle. Unless water use is drastically reduced, severe water shortages will affect the entire planet by 2040. Switzerland is repeatedly recognized as a country with the best quality tap water in the world. The country has strict water treatment standards and superior natural resources, with an average rainfall per year of 60.5 inches. In fact, 80% of drinking water comes from natural springs and groundwater. While 97.5% is seawater unfit for human consumption in both populations and temperatures are ever rising, meaning that the fresh water we do have is under severe pressure. Water demand globally is projected to increase by 55% between 2000 and 2050. We're halfway there. There's not an infinite supply of water. Desalination is the process of purifying saline water into potable fresh water, basically turning ocean water into drinkable fresh water. Reverse osmosis and distillation are the most common ways to desalinate water. Reverse osmosis water treatment pushes water through small filters, leaving salt behind. The water you drink may be composed of the same water molecules that have been around since life started on the Earth 4.6 billion years ago. It is possible to make water, theoretically. It is possible. You would need to combine two moles of hydrogen gas and one mole of oxygen gas to turn them into water. However, you need activation energy to join them together and start the reaction. Every year, 2.7 billion people experience water scarcity at least once a month a year. By, 20, by 2025, two-thirds of the water will affect the world's population, and they may be facing water shortages. Its official California is the dirtiest state in the country, and that's as of January 19, 2021. The 10 worst states for clean water... Alaska, Montana, Vermont, Maine, West Virginia, Oklahoma, Idaho, New Mexico, New Hampshire, and Wyoming. When you look at the 10 best states for clean water, it's Hawaii, Alabama, Tennessee, Illinois, South Carolina, Florida, Georgia, Massachusetts, Mississippi, and Kentucky. So test your water. Know the water that you're drinking. The state enduring the worst drought is Utah, according to drought monitor data for the week ending July 12, 2021. Due to geography, climate engineering, regulations, and competition for resources, some regions seem relatively flush with fresh water. While others face drought and debilitating pollution, in much of the developing world, clean water is either hard to come by or a commodity that requires laborious work or significant currency to obtain it. Water is life. Do your homework and do your DD. You only owe it to yourself. Facts, truth, honesty, mindset, wealth is knowledge, and that's survival. This is a disclaimer note. 
I'm only responsible for what I say, not for what you understand. Buy now or pay later. WTII, they're a safe bet on a safe play. With their weather technology, they're definitely going up with the AWG, with the atmospheric water generator. They're putting themselves in a good niche place in the market tree where I'd say that they're a strong investment to look at in the future. Remember, I'm not a stockbroker, not a financial advisor. I'm not a financial analyst, advisor. I'm just a blue-collar worker trying to pay it forward, let people know of a few things that are out there. WTII is ahead of the game. With the resources they have and their product line, they're worth checking out. Truth is people want to take your spot until they realize what it takes to play your position. Know your position and play your position well. If you have time, go and read whitehouse.gov. When you go on to whitehouse.gov, go and look at the fact sheet for the American Job Plan, March 31st, 2021, for statements and release. Invest some time, read through it, and understand where our government's headed, so that way you can better prepare your family and know the things as a citizen that may be coming out from the government ahead. Americans rely on oil. Sustainability with winter ahead, we've seen rolling blackouts. We've seen natural disasters hit states, coastal lines, and we've seen what it does to the United States. The United States is the number one oil consumption by country, with China in number two. Without oil, cars may become a relic of the past. Streets may turn into public community centers and green spaces filled with pedestrians. Bike use might increase as more people ride to school or work. The earth will become itself again. It will begin to heal from over a century of human-caused climate change. If we keep burning fossil fuels at our current rate, it is generally estimated that all our fossil fuels will be to- will be depleted by 2060. So are you in the one-third part of the 2.7 billion who experience water scarcity at least once a month a year? By 2025, two-thirds of the world's population may be facing water shortages. What will you do if you're one of those people? Remember the Population Fund warned that the world will begin to run out of fresh water by 2050. Service is truth. This is just an announcement, just to put, pay it forward, put information out there so you can do your DD and your homework. Some areas may not be affected as hard as other areas, but other areas may be extremely impacted compared to those where you live. That will push populations in different places. People will outsource and people will continue to move. It will change the geography of the whole world as we know it. Water is life. Know how to have potable water. Get some tablets if you need to. Know how to use chlorine. Know how to boil and have canisters to keep water in. Maybe look at draining your hot water tank. Knowing how to drain your hot water tank and the sources of fresh water still in your house. If a natural disaster happened and you had to live for three days or a week or two weeks. Devise a plan now before we get into 2022 and before we head towards 2025. Before you know it, we'll be in 2030 and then 2040 will come and then we'll be facing that water scarcity even more. Right now is the time to take action. Right now is the time to devise a plan. I hope everyone has a safe year and finishes their 2021 strong and you look forward to having a strong 2022. It may mean that you need to move. It may mean that you need to relocate in the future. But water is life and it's survival. And your family is important. So do what's best for your family.